Mimicking is an art where one creature mimics other for certain advantages, certain benefits. In the world of human life, if you will see, there are many artists who mimic other for certain kind of benefits, certain advantages and for, you can say, just for their bread and butter. In animal world, mimic is done for a certain reason and the only advantage here which is included is to save their life from predators. On the screen, what you are seeing right now is a common wolf snake, Lycodon olicus. It is a renowned mimic artist wherein it mimics the most ferocious common crate Bungarus chiroleus. This mimicking of Bungarus chiroleus or uh, common crate gives it an upper hand wherein some of the predators get confused by looking at it and thinking it as a venomous crate. But certain times this mimicking turns the table and it becomes a kind of uh, thing where this snake gets killed because it looks like carrots. Yes, you heard it right. Certain times it happens when uh, certain people, generally humans, do this. And recently we encountered uh, one man who actually killed a common wolf snake because he thought it of being a carrot. So common wolf snake is actually a non-venomous snake which actually uh, constricts its prey to death and then it, it swallows it. Uh, recently we have uploaded a video wherein you have seen uh, a common wolf uh, killing a skink by uh, constricting it with its hard grip. Now you can see that actual that posture it is its defensive posture where the head of it is hidden under the body. Now we will try to take it out from the box and uh, it will be a kind of different experience to see what it does actually. And since it, sli it uh, slided out very effectively, so the posture that it was in got broke. And now you can see it is moving and the bands on its body is clearly visible. Why the name Lycodon olicus or wolf snake is given because Lycodon itself means uh, wolf tooth wherein the maxillary and the mandibulary tooth of this snake is uh, actually just like wolf uh, a wolf which is mammal the canines of the mammal and they are sharp enough to give lethal bite these snakes are actually very uh, fast and swift and they like to move during night and they are nocturnal but certain times they can be seen during the daytime although the behavior during the daytime is more on the timid side than being bold rescuing snake is as much as important as the releasing part when you are re rescuing any snake you have to release it as soon as possible one of our viewers asked a question that uh, what is the time where we can release the snake or what is the actual time of captivity so there is no uh, such thing where you can keep the long for captivity according to the standard operating protocols SOP you can keep a rescued snake for not more than 24 hours within 24 hours you have to release it anyhow possible but in our opinion you must release it as soon as possible because keeping the snakes longer will make them turn into traumatic situation wherein the survival chances of the snake will decrease by the passing time. The more you will keep them in captivity, the more they will feel uneasy. And it also depends on what kind of a thing you use. A few of uh, viewers and certain rescuers, they have asked us what kind of uh, uh, rescuing equipments will be good, will, be, uh, will a box will be okay or a kind of cotton cloth. So box is also okay where it provides security to the rescuer also and also the bag is good where it uh, wherein the the opaque nature of the cloth will make the snake more calm and cool. When you are keeping it in box you have to remember that the plastic boxes trap heat very soon so as you have kept it in box Within 30 to 45 minutes, you have to release it in the nearby suitable habitat. That is the standard 
operating protocol of rescuing and releasing snakes so uh, friends uh, more such for more such detailed videos you please you can uh, subscribe our channel team asian prakriti or hum that's all for today's videos folks jai hind vande mataram